in the shimmering desert oasis of Dubai where ambition and grandeur converge, a figure emerges captivating the world with his enigmatic presence. Veiled in a tapestry of intrigue and mystique, he is none other than the Crown Prince of Dubai, Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, also known as Fazza. A symbol of modernity and aspiration, he personifies the extraordinary vision that has transformed Dubai into a global icon of innovation and opulence. Step into the world of Dubai's enigmatic crown prince and unlock the mysteries that lie within his realm, particularly his love story. Before you begin watching this video, make sure you're subscribed to our channel. With a smile that lights up the skyline and an adventurous spirit that knows no bounds, Sheikh Hamdan is the epitome of a modern-day Arabian night. Whether he's scaling towering mountains, diving into the depths of the Arabian Gulf, or capturing breathtaking moments through his lens, this royal explorer radiates a contagious energy that makes you want to jump out of your seat and join his extraordinary escapades. Born on November 14, 1982, he is the second son of Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the vice president and prime minister of the UAE and the ruler of Dubai. From his daring stunts to his love for poetry and his unwavering commitment to environmental causes, Sheikh Hamdan proves that being a royal doesn't mean leaving your sense of fun and adventure at the palace gates. But as sources would have it, not all things are fun-filled and happy with the prince, particularly regarding his love life. Recently, the Crown Prince of Dubai, Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed, took to Instagram with an image of his infant son, Sheikh Mohammed bin Hamdan. Sheikh Hamdan's hand is seen tenderly embracing his baby in the touching black and white image that was uploaded to his Instagram. He used a straightforward blue heart emoji as the photo's caption. On February 25th, Sheikh Hamdan published a social media post announcing the birth of his son. He tweeted a photo of two tiny feet being held by two hands and prayed, Dear God, make him bloom well, make him the sight of our eyes, and make him a blessing for us. Mohammed bin Hamdan bin Mohammed Al Maktoum was discovered to be the name of the newborn prince. An image of Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid, vice president and ruler of Dubai, holding the baby in his arms was posted by Sheikh Hamdan too. In the background of the image showing three generations of the Dubai royal family, Sheikh Hamdan is seen looking on. His previous set of twins are Sheikh Rashid and Sheikh Ashaika, who were born on May 20th, 2021, to him and his wife and first cousin, Sheikh Ashaika bint Saeed. The couple got married in May of 2019. The Crown Prince of Dubai is well known for his passion of exploration and has been sighted in remote locales, riding horses, skydiving, cycling, climbing, and so much more. Earlier in 2023, Sheikh Hamdan took his twins skiing in Southeast France's Courchevel. He uploaded a number of images of himself skiing and having fun in the snow with his kids, while being joined by the photographer Ali Issa. He can be seen dragging the twins on a sleigh in one photograph, while the prince comes across as a very loving and playful father through the numerous features of his kids through his Instagram, we do seem to hear nary a peep from the woman on everyone's mind, the mother to the children, Fazza's wife, Sheikha Shaika Thani Al Maktoum. Fazza's marriage to his cousin was of course arranged, and according to some reports, things haven't always been going well. And as rumors would have it, Things seemed at an all-time low when Sheikh Athani found out about Hamdan's connection with his ex-lover, Hadia Zen. These rumors, of course, began to surface when Sheikh Ashaika made a drastic trip to London, leaving behind Fazza and the kids. As sources would have it, the beautiful Hadia Zen would make a ravishing appearance at the palace during the COVID-19 pandemic in early August of 2020. 
Some even went as far as to say that Hamdan had in fact married Hadia, and that the pair supposedly had a secret wedding whereby only the prince's closest family were allowed to attend. Seems shocking, right? Sources have also claimed that the marriage had not been well received by the prince's father and vice president of the UAE, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum. And rightfully so. The ruler of Dubai had arranged the match between his son and niece after the death of Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed bin Sultan Al Narayan, the former president of the UAE. This, of course, as was tradition, a move to garner favor and strengthen his own legacy among the Emirati royals. Nevertheless, the crown prince was never known to back down. He reportedly ventured on a journey to London in June of 2022, shortly after his first wife left, to win back her favor as well as the favor of his family and in-laws. Supposedly, such a scandal had been covered under millions of dollars, one which would reportedly make things well and said between the couple and their families. Shortly after returning, Hamdan was spotted on vacation with his wife and children, a rather optimistic endeavor and a plight to finally put rumors and baseless accusations to rest. Moreover, Sheikh Hamdan's love for poetry, photography, and philanthropy reflects his multifaceted personality and genuine desire to make a positive impact. Through his verses and lens, he captures the beauty of life and shares profound insights, leaving a lasting impression on those who follow his journey. Not to mention, his philanthropic efforts further demonstrate his commitment to education, environmental conservation, and improving the lives of others. As we continue to follow Sheikh Hamdan's remarkable life, we can expect to witness more exhilarating adventures, innovative initiatives, and heartfelt endeavors that shape not only Dubai, but also inspire individuals to dream big, push boundaries, and create a positive impact in their own communities. And surely, we can only hope for the absolute best in regards to him and his wife. What are your thoughts on today's video? Have anything else you'd like to add? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. We'll catch you later.